<laughs> now, I did warn you, it's not Windows on the World. Uh, it's uh, very authentic. It's real. Or is it just sound patronizing? No, 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 not at all. It is authentic. It is real. It's a working man's diner. Can I'm going to keep my coat on three well, Thank you very much. Uh, however, the food is delicious, but... Without a maitre d', I suggest we grab that available booth. Well, this, uh, this is why we're here, to eat. And, uh, oh, Mel said this was the, uh, best lunch spot in town. Oh, and Mel was passionate about food. Yeah, Mel was passionate about everything. Yes, he was. <sighs> is your friend Carlotta here? I don't see her. Mel said, uh, I just had to try her flan. Ah, well, Carlotta is a treasure. Mel's words exactly. Dorian, you are a vibrant, beautiful woman. And you will never lack male companionship if you want it. No one would ever be able to replace Mel in my heart. Hey, man, I'd be a fool to even try. And a bit of a masochist. <laughs> you see, I, um, I am the town pariah. Uh, you're taking your chances being seen with me at all. If you're trying to scare me off, it won't work. I'm a risk taker. Hi. Hi. Isn't it a beautiful day? Yes, it is. You're in a good mood. Did you murder Nora? <laughs> no. Better. We've come to a understanding. So I think things are finally going my way. I'm relieved to hear that. So who are you having coffee with? An old friend of Mel. Oh. Where is he? He said he was going to step out for a moment, and uh, that he'd be right back. Should I be adding another place setting at the wedding party? I think that might be a bit premature. Yes, but not entirely out of the question, right? <laughs> yeah, I think it would be nice if he decided to stay around Landview for a while, yes. And here he is. You again. gallery. I was looking for you, actually. Uh, as a matter of fact, I don't think I got a chance to introduce myself. I'm Drake Faraday. Cynthia Rappaport. Soon to become Buchanan. You bought me tulips. Well, well the table needed something. <laughs> you say so. The truth is, when we walked by the flower stand, I wanted to get them for you, but I didn't because I thought maybe I'm being presumptuous. But suddenly, you know, being here, I thought, why not? So, am I being presumptuous? Not in the least. Do you have a habit of being presumptuous? Uh, sometimes. Well, maybe I should presume to find a vase. If you'll excuse me. What's going on? I told you, he's a friend of Mel's. And that's why you're so... Glowy. Glowy? Oh, please. I hardly know the man. Exactly. <laughs> so do me a favor, will you? Play hard to get. Why? Do you know him? I know his type. But anyway, that's not what I'm here to talk to you about. I have important things to discuss. Of course. Let me guess. You. No. You. I want you to be my matron of honor. After everything that happened. Thank you. Is that a yes? Of course it's a yes. I would be honored. I do have some other pretty important news. Yeah, what would that be? It's a secret. 
Lindsay, please, no, no more secrets. It's a good secret, though. Really good, I promise. Really? I have to go. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. now you walk out. <laughs> Terrific. Uh, what do you think? Do you like them? They're beautiful. 